I think it crashed already. <laughs> I think, I think it crashed already. <laughs> Certainly seems like it did. Strange. Let's try this again. It's a good start. Alright. Let's see. Ball rolling. All right, so I don't know who this extreme male person is. You subscribed to me, and that's cool. Well, you followed me, and I like it, and I'm happy, but I mean, you've been in my chat forever, so I'm a little weirded out and confused. I don't even know if you talk. That's the more intriguing part of it. I don't know if you're a real person, or if you're a robot, or what's going on. <sighs> I think the game might have crashed again. Awkward. <laughs> Damn it. Why? Weird. I mean, the music's still playing well and good. Things are happening. Strange things. Yeah, 
Let's uh hmm. Give it to me a minute. Then you're gonna see it's uh it's hard crashing. I had to force close it now. What the fuck's going on, huh? I need to check my CPU usage real quick and see what's going on. I haven't had this problem ever. All the same things are open, all the same stuff's running. 81% memory drain. What's draining it? CPU just spiking for some reason. Weird. And my C drive is just going mad trying to load. At least the internet's holding good. <laughs> That's a good thing. All right. All right, let's give this a shot again. See what happens. This is where I crashed last time. If it crashes again here, I'm just gonna have to restart the PC. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's going on. It's obviously not not good. It's not supposed to be happening. But yeah, it looks like it's uh. Looks like it's either crash again. Oh, maybe. Okay. So it's loading, but it's not showing it's loading. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. That's a lie. <laughs> Okay. Jesus. That that was a task. That was that was some work.
Just want to make sure all those upgrades are still there since we had that problem last time. <sighs> Alright. So. It's been like two days since I've played. My brain's a little squishy. Let's get down to the water. Let's look around real fast. Get my bearings on right. Okay. So. Welcome aboard, Captain. What we needed is we need to get thermal power production. We need to get thermal power production back into uh, into both. Where is it at? Where is that? Why is it showing? Why ain't it showing the Cyclops? Is that the Cyclops turned off for some reason? New blueprints. New bloops. Oh, cooked eye eye and preserved red eye. Gotcha. Alright, let's turn all my beacons off. We're gonna turn the thermal plant back on. Base echo. Pit of Death, Prawn Suit, Cyclops, Seamoth. There. Thanks. Alright, it's probably because it's so close I can't see its, its beacon. But let's check. Prawn suit, I wanted to get uh, the grappling arm, which is an advanced wiring kit. Hmm. Uh, I also wanted to get this kyanite uranium advanced wiring kit for the thermal charger. Seems like a good call. Uh, and finally, so grappling arm. Advanced jump jet, which is a plasteel ingot. That's the bad thing. That's the part that sucks. So, one, two, three, four, five. Six. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Memory is functioning now. The hum of a nuclear reactor next to my face. So first, one of the biggest issues we have I wonder if I put pieces of scrap metal in there if he'll use them and he'll just drop teeth because that would be interesting. So we'll need to test that theory too. Alright. So let's see, what uh, what storage do we have on here? What do we have? Do we have uh, We've got the MK3 and we have a pressure comp, but we don't need either of those. So we're going to jump down here. Acclimate my vision. <laughs> we're come up. Access upgrades here. And I'm going to take both of those and I'm going to put the pressure comp on him. <laughs> Our batteries have not fully charged yet. There we go. 
So now we've got two pits of storage on there. We've got uh, the Seamoth defense perimeter system, and we've got the pressure uh, compensator. Next, I need to turn on this beacon for Shockwave. Because we are going to go to Shockwave. Shockwave has lithium. First things first, we're going to check and see if it's night or day out. It's kind of day, so I guess we'll just go. This being our quickest mode of transportation. Problem is, so fast it takes the map a second to load because the more shit I keep piling into this poor computer, the harder it is for it to keep up with all the shit I wanted to do. Any uh, if I do come across any scrap, caution dehydration detected certainly picking it up and taking it for myself. Do I have any water on me? <laughs> nope. Looks like we need to get to that island pretty quick then. Back off. Sources on the edge here. But it's just easier if I go inside. Well, on the island, not really inside the island. Try and get some more water in my system. There we go. Switch up to the flashlight. And let's see if we can't find myself some more lithium up here. I should be able to. I didn't gather all of it. And I know there was a whole section that I was too full on inventory to even take anything. So... Hmm. The crawlers are all missing. I don't like it.
if I go this way, and then this way, it should take me to that spot I was talking about here. Right here, there should be a whole ton of lithium around. See? Uh-oh. Taking the lithium froze the game. Oh, it's not boding well. It's gonna be a long night. <laughs> I can tell already. I mean, I don't really need gold, but I'll take gold. See? It's just everywhere. And really, I'm just grabbing the gold for, uh... Well... Not grabbing that diamond, though. Fell through the map. Oh, shit. So we need to get lithium for plasteel. That was fishes that just swam past my face through an island. Hmm. They say it doesn't bode well for me. None of this is boding well for tonight. Wait, what? I forgot all about that artifact. Well, shit! Lesson learned. Always try and explore the entirety of the island. Oh. I hate going slow, but I have to because if I run, it just lags the island. It's upsetting. Ow. I can't wait till I have enough money to upgrade this computer again. <laughs> no, I say again, but it was a it was a decently priced gift from a friend. But it definitely showing me with what's happening now that it does need some minor upgrades. For sure. Oh, my inventory's full already. Huh? Oh! oh. <gasps> that was a mistake! I didn't mean it. I don't even know what's in the water around here. <laughs> Hopefully nothing bad. Uh-oh. Alright. Let's see if I can... Get back over to my ship. Seamoth. Which needs to be renamed after the one viewer half. Which I haven't forgot, I just haven't got around to doing just about yet, but it will happen. So. Let's take a minute. No, no. Don't, don't enter the sea mob. Open the storage of the sea mob. Alright. Well, that's good. Alright, that's Pit Death. Echo's over there. 
I'm just gonna sort of descend a little bit because I don't like things sneaking up on me from the bottom. Like those little assholes. I want to find... That's a good start. I'm gonna access this, set that to 1. Pop out, scan. Now we gotta collect some, uh... Some gracious amounts. Titanium. I don't know what that is. Freaks me out though. Welcome aboard, Captain. Let's get a closer look. So my up and down aren't functioning too well on my my mouse. So I'm gonna need to fix whatever's wrong with that too. I've never converted over. like it was supposed to. Check these floating islands. Y'all infected bastards, go away. Alright. Now we start the fun run of this. Gonna start gathering as much scrap metal as possible, I guess. I'm gonna need to remember to keep one to drop inside the tank. Oh, render. Rendering issues. Life pod three? I think I've been to you already. Yeah, I have.
Oh, dead fish. Another dead fish. Let's grab this stalker egg. Unidentified creature egg? What? I thought I had that one identified as a stalker egg. Is it a different egg? Ooh! Alright, we're gonna try it out. Oh, there it is! doing right now is, like I said, looking for scrap metal or things I can scan to give me more titanium because it is an, a mandatory thing. I just heard fucking gasopod assholes. Must be that close. Let's see if I can harvest any of these. There's a buggy problem with harvesting this. I'm definitely gonna need some. How much does that give me? Enough space to grab at least one more little piece of scrap. Ugh. They're like a less graceful manatee. Jeez. That scrap? No. You hear him? You hear what I mean? Whoopi Goldberg and a manatee became one. That's what the gasopods would be like. Is that some? It looks like it's some. It is indeed some salvage. Alright. Let's make a run back down to uh, Pit of Death. As quick as possible. Let's keep this thing rigged to shock the shit out of everyone. Hey, what's up, Death? Sorry, I couldn't see chat for a second there. If you hit uh, exclamation point rank, I set up uh, I set up a whole bunch of stuff with this new thing called Phantom Bot. Um, I'm working on building like a point system to make it fun to be in the chat. And the longer you're in here, you gain rank. And then the longer you're in here, you can become what's called a regular, etc. Blah blah blah. And gain new features. I'm trying. That's what I was working on all Sunday and a little bit of today. And it's a good thing you're a little late because. The beginning of this chat was just god awful. Oh my. The game crashed like three times. See? Interesting. Now, granted, you have been here longer and it's rank. I, I already have you set up with the proper time. I did some math and stuff. So I, I have to go through the process of trying to change that myself. But. The longer you're in here, you gain points, and the points will be used probably for other things. I haven't thought of stuff yet. I'm just trying to think of ways to make it interesting. Ew. There's a frickin' infected brain crab stuck in the map. Oh my. Ugh. 
<laughs> Retreat! Yeah, I know. You're already set up with, well, like, the correct time. It's trying to say you're eight hours away from the rank, but maybe, I don't know. Maybe, uh, I forget. I think you, it might be ranking you at the right rank. I don't, I'm too afraid to, like, tab out and check because I was getting some problems earlier with all that. It was a pain in the ass. I tabbed out to do something and the game crashed on the loading screen. So. <clears throat> new monster egg. It says it's new. I thought it was a, a stalker egg, but apparently I'm wrong. It's not a stalker egg. So we're just gonna... It might be a gasopod egg. But that certainly looked like a stalker egg, doesn't it? And the other thing I wanted to check... He's in here. I wonder if I drop... Eh, it won't let me drop Metal Salvage. I was curious if I could drop Metal Salvage and he would, like do what he does in the wild. You know, picks it up to gather, to drop his teeth and whatnot. And yeah, you usually are always here, so you'll probably be like one of the one of the first regular viewers I mod whenever, if ever, the chat ever gains more people. And you'll have the rank of moderator and all that stuff. Uh, I didn't go to base A yet. I haven't, I haven't stopped there. We're probably going to have to go back to get some of the magnetites I picked up. Just to bring it here. But right now I'm working on stocking up for... Uh... Yeah. I gotta stock up before we get into the nope zone. That way I have uh, charge ability and whatnot. So let's go back here. I'm going to store this. Right now, I'm just sort of doing random runs for titanium and other things, and I'm probably going to have to go build more lockers in here, too. That needs to go in the ship. How much did this have? 100%? Yeah, that's what I thought. But I imagine there's a whole metric fuck ton of them. Right they are. Okay, we've got some titanium in there, we've got some titanium in the base. I have lithium on the seamoth I need to grab. I need to drink some water. I need to do a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah. It's probably what I'm going to have to do. I need to go out and gather some more quartz, though. I don't really want to touch my quartz supply that's in here. And there's more than enough quartz floating around. Outside. Like, I have... I have a good deal here. One locker, two locker, three locker, four locker, five locker, six locker. Establish that is my primary. I found another purple artifact. I wasn't sure if you were there when I found it. I went up to the main island and gathered a lot of lithium and wound up going through a path that I took previously that I forgot existed and <laughs> ended up picking up uh, 
an extra purple artifact, which is good. I watched, I cheated, I watched a couple videos to try and find that entrance, and I don't care. Because I didn't know, I had no idea where it was, and I did not feel like pissing around with, uh, ye old sea dragon. Playing games of hide and go seek with him to figure out where I had to go. Six thirty. Yeah, ten minutes ago you might have missed it by a hair, or you might have seen it. Either way, it's fine. It's not like you missed anything crazy or detrimental. I just found an extra thing. Alright. I'm gonna take these. Well. Caution. Mild dehydration detected. Fluid intake okay. recommended. <laughs> Linda, I don't need you breathing down my neck. Keep that. Gerd. I'm gonna need to go and try and find another copper ore supply. I know there's a few around here. Vital signs stabilizing. I think another thing I'm gonna build is one of those, uh. <clears throat> water cultivators, because I think, I'm pretty sure that nuclear reactor can handle it. <laughs> there usually are, you were not wrong. So far it's just been a whole leisurely gathering of things, so nothing too crazy just yet. It's actually been a little too quiet, but like I said, there was some crashing in the game, and me being angry about it crashing. Two titanium? Oh, Jesus, that's so easy to make. I'm making it right now. I don't even care. On top of making a little extra storage, that was buggy. You can't plant blood kelp. I tried. I gave it the old honest scout try and it didn't do it. So. Kinda sucks, but just means that where we're at, we are more than capable of accessing some blood kelp. One, two, one, two, there. One for this, and then one to put in the new, uh, new water filtration device. Now all we're missing is the two lockers in the back. But yeah, those blood kelp trees out there constantly produce blood kelp oil, and they just, like, roll down the ground and roll down to me. Like, hey, here you go, bro. Alright, let's put you right here. What's power drain gonna be like? Oh, it keeps up, but no problem. Nuclear reactor's like, I got this. Install another one, bro. See what I care. Can I put one at an angle? Because that'd be pretty cool. Oh. Oh, water for days. Boy, we're going to see just how much this nuclear reactor can keep up with. <laughs> What's the, what are the cores looking like? They're still, they haven't used up. I don't know when they use up, if they use up, how they use up. I don't know. This is all, it's all a test. So we'll try this. Just to see what happens, I guess. I'm liking the idea of putting one there. Put one there. 
Oh man, and it keeps up. I love it. Is it dark outside? Can I sleep? Yes, I can. Sleeping will help those things produce more water and help the batteries charge quicker because it's like an accelerated timer. Mm. Alright, so they kept up a little bit. I mean, that's still pretty damn good. Because three of these would never have been able to stay active at the other base. I should probably make a repulsion cannon at some point. And I already have a diamond hard blade. We haven't really found anything new, sadly. It kind of bums me out a little bit. That egg hatch yet? It's probably pretty close. Where did, uh... Oh, there he is. I was going to say, where'd ye old stalker go? <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, let's, uh, I'm gonna take a second. My OCD is gonna kick in. I have the storage, I'm gonna do it now. I'm gonna try and spread this out. to it. Like I said, it's... The reactor core is new to me. I haven't... I haven't used one yet. It was, you know, we'll just have to keep an eye on it and watch the rods and make sure they're okay. Put lead there. I guess I'll just keep this kind of what it is, a mixture of like organic, inorganic, stored, non-stored. Alright. I think I had more lithium in here. Other side, huh? Yep. I'll keep some of this lithium down here. Those are almost charged. I'm gonna go and explore around the blood kelp area in the sea moth. Gather some of the quartz that's around here. Oh, don't hit that. And I'm also gonna look and see if I can't find any more nodes in this area that I can uh, check out and see what they are. Look at all this. There's, you know, see, there's blood oil right there. Ow! No! We are not friends. away. Is that copper? Yeah, that's copper. Oh. 
know there's a friggin' crab squid around here. There he is. That's gold. Ugh. It's the infected crab squid, no less. Two second sound delay. I would have to assume that that small delay is probably because two streams are happening off of the same internet. I can try and fix it in OBS, but I'm not sure. I guess for now we'll just have to rough it. Just have to try and ignore the fact there's a two second delay until the other stream ends and I can try and readjust my stream. There's so much quartz here. uranium here too. Yeah, I'm keeping an eye on the stream through my phone this time just because, you know, there's two streams running and I'm not sure how it's going to handle. Alright, he sounds a little too close for comfort. wasn't as close as I thought. sound terrifying. What'd we learn? <laughs> learn to stay the shit away from my shit. What the hell? <laughs> I doubt this will work. I didn't think that would work. we'll take this back over, charge it, and we'll take out the prawn and harvest up those two copper notes since copper is running pretty low. Welcome aboard, Captain. Alright, that sounds like a plan. I can probably introduce some of the peepers. This one's getting pretty full. I'll have to wait until I can add another segment to it before I add peepers. You know what I mean? It's good. I think the tanks have like X amount of fish per tank level. I think it's like 10 fish per tank, so right now we can have 30 fish. I think. I think that's how it works. I don't really remember. But uh, I'm going to convert a good deal of this, uh, this quartz into glass.
much do I have left? I'm gonna keep that much. And I'll just uh, come up here. Two glass, yeah. Let's see if I could destroy structural integrity. Two, four, six. Two, four, six. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. I don't, I don't mind wasting it. There's one window. I, don't, I already noticed I did the math wrong. Alright. I don't know what window that one's for. Probably this one. Maybe not? Maybe it's for the upper windows. Alright, let's go up here and let's just queue all those. Yep, that took it away. Okay, mm so this tank is only, what, one, two, two high. So to make it a third tank high, let's go up top and check. I need four glass and two titanium. Was it two titanium or was it eight titanium? Eight titanium. I math good. running. Next thing I'm gonna do is in here I guess I'll uh, check and see the costs. Wall, module, computer chip, copper wire, glass, titanium. So we have the glass we need. I don't think we have the copper in here. There's two titanium. I don't think we have any copper in here, really. I think it's all on the ship. So there's the computer chip. Which might as well take the gold from here, too. Yeah, that's what it's looking like. They'll stay sh they'll stay tiny. But I think they have like I think there's a limit to how many fish will fit in a tank. That way they don't breed infinitum. You know. Cause I feel like these fish, there should have been a lot more in here by now. So let's go hop in Yield Death Clan. Welcome aboard, Captain. That's gold. I'm not gonna worry about that right at this second. That's copper. Friggin' everywhere. Oh. 
Yeah, you don't want to mess with me next time, buddy. I'll punch you in the face. Punch you in the face so hard you'll never know who punched you in the face. <laughs> I don't know what he was like, hoping to accomplish there. I am. You were correct. We should definitely go back up there and check it here. We'll stop off and check it because I need to, uh... I need to go gather more titanium, so we'll be taking the Seamoth out to go check for more anyways. Gather up some gold to fill the gold locker. Oh, Linda, I know. I can tell when I'm thirsty. I appreciate her concern, but Jesus. Now, I know there was another store, another deposit back here. And I'm pretty sure it was copper. So we'll just have to check. I think it was that one. Kinda looks like gold, though. Yeah, that was gold. No, 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 no. That's gold. How far up was I to find that copper? Better question. Not today, son. Not today. That looks like copper, though. <coughs> Gather this and go get some, uh, some H2O. Water sucks. It really, really sucks. Water sucks. It really, 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 really sucks. It sucks. It sucks. <laughs> Copper? Oh, don't, uh, don't do that to me. Copper. 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 <laughs> I really just don't don't want to leave the sanctity of this shell of defense that I'm in with all those assholes around us. All right, let's go back down. About the hide right. Emergency. Severe dehydration. Detected. Seek fluid intake immediately. I love that this thing can fall like 900 feet and it's like, nah man, I'm good. Welcome aboard, Captain. Can't run too much quicker. Dying of dehydration. Yeah. 
Yoink. Vital signs stabilizing. He. Wait. Wait a minute. Yoink. <laughs> Let's go make a thing of glass. That should give us the space to create. Yeah, the his nope, nope, nope when he ran into the sea dragon. Oh, I watched it just because I'm already there in my in my uh, uh my la well, I should say hours. It's more hour live stream. It's not my live stream. It's your live stream too. So let's see. Let's deposit this gold and take one more bit of copper. That should be enough now to create a computer chip and copper wire and titanium and glass. And that should be enough to make that battery charger right there. Right meow. Now let's reload this about no no stop stop getting ahead of yourself game oh all right well let's just unload this battery then let's charge them both so let's store this good not that store all this quartz open up some space. I'll put uranium in here for now. I'll use one of these. I need to eat some food. Oh, uh, so much to do. Did it hatch? It hatched. What was it? It was another stalker. Why did it tell me that that creature egg was not a stalker egg then? I'm so confused. Let's see to Reggie. Reggie and a Hoover. Alright. <laughs> I still don't want to make friends with it. That thing, like, <laughs> yeah. They had a better encounter than I had, that's for damn sure. Their encounter seemed a hell of a lot more peaceful. Though I do wonder if my stasis rifle, when I fully charge it, if I hit him, if I can freeze him and scan him. I c Uh, I want to try, but I don't want to try. You know what I mean? It's like... <laughs> internal feelings of anguish and fear and pain suffering and just just a whole bunch of emotions all right let's gather the rest of the copper out of here one gold let's check this double check the prawn suits uh, thing Three kyanite, three uranium, and an advanced wiring crystal. I probably could definitely make that. And the grappling arm is two advanced wiring kits and titanium. So we need three advanced wiring kits. Five kyanite, sulfur. Alright. Let's see. Let's store the copper. I 
don't... I didn't set up a locker with copper yet, did I? I didn't have any in here. Yeah. I did not. So let's store the gold. Let's store the copper here. What are my other guns looking like? Let's check. Alright, let's uh, reload this. Uh, re now, buttons, fingers, work. There. Let's reload. And reload. for the stasis right now. Another advanced wiring kit, battery, and titanium. Well, the good thing is, is the battery is empty, and if I recall, there's a bug. Yeah, yeah. Well, I already, I already planned on taking two purple artifacts with me in there. Uh, so... It was good that I saw that. It was already my intention. Alright, let's make a stasis rifle real fast, just in case. Uh, advanced wiring kit, battery, titanium. So we're going to need three gold, two copper, one, two, one, two, three, one. We're also going to need... Uh, Actually, I'd... I know what we need. I was gonna say, actually, that should be it, but I'm not. I'm, I'm stupid. But I'm not that stupid. Alright, electronics, copper wire. Let's check this. Need a computer chip? Advanced wiring kit, titanium battery. Alright, just the advanced wiring kit. I know they used to take computer chips too. So now we'll make the advanced wiring kit. We'll go personal, tools, stasis rifle. Interesting bug. Stasis rifle should be fully charged. Used an empty battery, fully charged it. Buggy game is buggy. <laughs> let's equip that to... Uh, let's equip it to two. Crash landed in an acid swamp of Boreal 9 and fought off arachnid kidney poachers before hijacking a tame star wall and riding it to safety. If he can do all that, you can survive one more day. Oh yeah. I wish they had upgrades for the stasis rifle too. That'd be great. Alright, we got the stasis rifle now. Form a self scan, see if anything new is happening. Nope. Oop, depleted core rod. Okay, okay, so we've depleted one. Nuclear waste. Now, there is a trash bin out there somewhere. We can search for it, and I'll craft it and put it in here that you can put nuclear waste into. It's actually called a nuclear waste bin. I know. You, it, yeah, it's a unique name, right? Alright, first thing I'll do, let's run back to main base. Welcome aboard, Captain. Shouldn't take me too long. Just go in this direction, and don't stop going in this direction. Now, once we get there, I'm probably going to try an alt-tab. See if it kills the game. Alright, so we're going to alternate the direction just a little bit. That way we're not going over that big open pit. And I'm kind of hoping that we might spawn in some more uh, scrap metal while we're at it. Oh, 
But it's not looking uh, very likely. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, it can be a weapon. <laughs> I mean, imagine the stasis rifle could be a weapon too if they added the right modifications to the game. I wonder, that should be a goal. Once we, uh... Once we're able to make our way inside of the, uh, the... Where's our legs? Ooh. Well, that's some shite rendering right there. There we go. <laughs> Welcome aboard, Captain. Alright, let's first let's check the power. Oh, he's still used. He's still being powered. That's impressive. I won't lie, I am impressed. Alright, let's grab these two waters. Let's eat a marble melon. Let's eat another marble melon. Now we got some water for our trip. Let's check the enormous amount of fish. Oh my word. There are so many Reginalds in there. Jesus. And a bunch of, uh... <laughs> a bunch of everything else. Yeah. Nice. Alright. I'm also gonna grab... Batteries. Grab that. Wish there was like an easier way. Let's reload. Reload. Turn it off. Reload. I guess. Let's charge that one. We took all of that. We have lead, but I'm probably gonna grab some more of this. Boom, oxide's empty. We have a lot of quartz up here, too. A couple lithium up here. A lot of gold. I'm gonna grab some more copper. I don't think we need any more silver down there. Table coral? Well fucking... we know that fucking song and dance. Just sort of wing it. Stalker teeth. I'll take a handful of stalker teeth. I probably could actually go out and grab a few more stalker teeth if I wanted to. Okay. Load it up on a whole bunch of, you know, garbage. Let's load up our storage. Alright. Okay, 
before I go anywhere. I'm gonna go to sleep. Cause it'd be dark as shit outside. <sighs> Yawn, stretch. come all the way up here. I'm gonna check my location to the Aurora. I think it's gonna be this way, huh? Indeed it is. Alright. There's probably gonna be a lot of scrap metal around the Aurora, so... We're gonna go that way. I know there is the one Reaper Leviathan there. Well, there's actually... I think there's a couple. There's like one down below it. There's the one out here in front of it by, uh... My life pod four, and then there's the other one back at the ass end of it, at the uh, thrusters. Already finding scrap metal. Nice. I don't know how much of that I can carry in my inventory though. An average handful. That's probably the max I could carry. Yeah, my inventory is full now. There's a good bit around here, so that's good to know. That's just a trash can. Pick up those last two. I mean, there's actually more. There's some there. And even some here, but I don't have the space for it. Which is okay by me. But I know there's a nuclear, uh, a nuclear trash can. That I can find. I know that much. Uh, there's also a coffee pod. Now I know this dick bag's near here, so I'm gonna keep my uh Hey! Evening extreme mail. There he is. Alright. All right, we're going to test something. And it's probably going to be really stupid. Let's get real stupid. Let's get even more stupid and get more... Let's get closer to him. Ugh. Oh, there he is. There he is. Nope, 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 nope. Mess that up. Get off of me. He's really going far away. Well, I guess I'd go far away too if some asshole just freaking electrocuted me. <laughs> oh. Whoa. Let's 
go after him. Now, now, now. Don't be so needy. Oops, well, I messed that up. <laughs> Jump the gun a little there. Don't you turn around and come back so quick. I'll be upset. Alright. I want to see if I can at least hit him. Power before I can, though. Whoop! Whoa. Now. God, he's so quick! <laughs> All I want to do is see if I can scan him. He's not making it easy. Stop it. Stop it. Did you give up? Running out of power on this thing. <sighs> Damn it. Alright, I'm just gonna reload it. Did it work? I mean, my <laughs> I'm stasis, but so is he. <laughs> As you can see, I'm turning the wheel, and it's not helping. No. Jeez, he hit so hard. I'm probably running out of battery though, in the actual Seamoth, so. This is gonna be like my last couple attempts. Alright, you know what? I'm too scared. It works. It's good to know. I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. Ugh, on that note. Okay. We know it can work. We know we can stasis him. That's... That's a good bit of knowledge to have, in my opinion. There's a lot of scrap around here, too. But I wanna... I wanna attempt to find... 
A, my coffee machine, and B, the nuclear waste deposit. Oh, so you're saying if I hit him with the... Uh, when, I hit, when I do nail him with the stasis, stasis him again to, to give a longer stasis? Is that what we're saying? That way I understand. Just to uh, clarify my brain, my brain pan. Ugh. Alright, I'll have to try it, but uh, the reason why I'm so leery and so scared is because this is a hardcore playthrough. So if I die, all the all the progress we've made through this stream is gone, and I have to start all the fuck over. So, I'd like to at least get to a point that I haven't been to before, and that would be getting inside of the, uh, inside of the alien contain- well, the alien, uh, power plant. Which is what we are kind of working on. We're doing that. I'm sort of just jacking off right now looking for something specific. Um, I'm looking for A, my coffee machine. Because I need coffee. <laughs> yeah, I saw you're like the real MVP. Because I was, like I said, I was there, but I wasn't there. If that makes sense. I was doing some shit with the Phantom Bot and doing some average things on uh, social media, getting stuff all squared away, trying to learn some new features. Uh, I was actually pretty shocked with how many people were in the vodcast. <laughs> the, the Sea Dragon is a Leviathan, and in my defense, I just know the Reaper's patterns a little better, <laughs> that's all. That's the only reason why I was comfortable doing that, because I know his, like, little back-and-forth wishy-washy patterns, but the only thing I don't trust is going inside of the, uh, the stasis bubble. Because I, I actually had a, uh, a hardcore game, I lost the hardcore game because of that. I, uh, I stasised a, uh, the gasopods to collect the gas pods. It was one of the ways you could do it without having a, uh, you know... Yeah, he won- he- he wants me to be friends with the dragon- oh, with the sea dragon. I know. I feel the same way. Uh, <laughs> but I stasis the gasopods to pick up the pods, and I don't know if it was lag, or if the game just hated me. But, uh, I went in, picked up two, and I know that my stasis still had more than enough time for me to gather them. My game glitched a little bit, and then I died because pods exploded all around me. So I was pretty, pretty upset, you know, a little pissed off. So I sort of, uh... well, that's good. I mean, hey, they're uh, they're put out for how like to view them wherever you want, however you want. YouTube just uh gives us that easier, you know, they are there forever. God damn it! It's not my coffee pot. It's not my coffee machine. And it's getting dark. YouTube makes it a little easier to watch, uh, you know, at your leisure. Uh, the way the vo uh, the uh, the vodcasts are gonna go is, it's gonna be like a weekly recap. Um, yeah, ouch! Indeed, I was so upset. <laughs> you know, you you lag out, and it's like a, a split second glitch, like what we have constantly in here, just because the game's not optimized. You know, you'll move, and it takes a minute to render. And it, next thing I know, it said you've you've died and lost all of the the save has been erased, and I'm like, oh, really? So now I don't really I I just I won't gather the pods without a uh, a repulsion or a propulsion cannon. It's just it's easier. They don't explode because they're stuck in that propulsion cannon stasis field. But uh, 
yeah, the way the vodcasts are going to go is like it'll be like a weekly recap. I play all week, Monday to Friday, six to six to ten, or Saturdays. Sometimes can be a little later, depending if you know me and the woman don't want to go out to eat or do like a, a regular life thing uh, instead of just streaming for everybody because it is kind of like a job, and I'm trying to do it as such because it's something I like to do. And I want you guys to like it too, though. Like, you know, if there's something you want to see change, you think something can be improved, don't be afraid to comment on the Facebook or just let me know. Uh, see what we can do. Uh, it's easier right now because, you know, there's only a handful of you that like me and watch me, and that's I'm fine with that. I don't mind. You know, it gives me a more connected way to communicate instead of having to communicate through, like, moderators and whatnot. But... The good thing is, is the people that are here in the beginning are the people who are in the running to be moderators in the future, you know. If you're gonna watch me more, you're gonna watch long enough, you get that time thrown in, you become people I know, you know, outside of friends that might want to do it, you know, viewers that have watched from the beginning or damn near beginning and watch a lot and watch enough, they're gonna be more considered for a moderator than anybody else. But for right now, it's just a casual fun stream of me jacking off and in the ocean. Uh, probably not the healthiest thing I could do for me or the fish, but um, just having fun with everybody. I'm, I'm, I'm spending like 20 minutes searching for a fucking coffee machine that doesn't do anything in the game but aesthetics, but I need it in my life. I just don't remember which crash site of the shallows it resides around. So I'm just, I'm just sort of swimming all through the shallows. Yeah, you've definitely got time under your belt there, Death, that's for sure. I don't know if Extreme keep do you keep the, like, the window constantly open, the chat open, or what? Because, like, when I check, you know, I, I check to see who's in, like, what's going on in chat or what's going on in my channel. And it, it says you're there, like, straight. And I'm like, geez. This man is committed. I'm like, don't get me wrong, death is committed, he's here too. But I mean, like... It's weird, I don't know if like it's bugged, if your account's bugged, if you're using the bot to have like constant viewing, you, you know, whatever makes it easier for you. I'm just not sure. Buggy Twitch is buggy. Maybe they remove the nuclear uh, trash can too. There's supposed to be... Because I found it before. Because a lot of my playthroughs that I've played of this have been on the console when I play. And ever since I bought this new gaming PC off my friend for a good price, you know, I've been getting used to, like, all the changes and updates to the PC. Like, there's a lot of things that have changed that I wasn't aware of. I wasn't, uh, you know, I wasn't in the know. So, they could have removed the trash can and not, I wouldn't even know. But it's a way to dispose of nuclear reactor rods. I'm, I'm just curious as to what it does, plus I want my coffee machine. Because I'm a fickle human being and I need, I need my amenities. I wouldn't see why they removed it. It's just like a random black trash can that says, like, nuclear waste on it. But I did... I started in a really weird area on uh, LifePod 5 this time. It was a, a spawn that I've never been spawned in, where, like, the distance to the location it was at. Eh. Like, swimming through jello with this lag sometimes. So I'm just sort of trying to, like, get my bearings on where I'm at and where everything else is at here. I'm, I'm pretty positive it was never in the, uh, the kelp fort, or the, uh, the seaweed jungle, kelp jungle, what the fuck ever. 
pretty sure it was never in there in there. It was up in like the shallow area, like where I'm at now. Where am I actually? Up close to my the Aurora. I should be far away. Yeah, I'm going away from it now. Good. Check out around here. Portion. Mild Shut up, hydration right detected. Fluid intake recommended. Okay, yeah, you're fucking right there, stabilizing. stabilizing. <laughs> I got bottled water. I is prepared. Alright, check this side real quick. Yeah, there's Life Pod 3 again. So I have made a definitive loop. Whee! Oh, I'm about to just friggin' Google it. <laughs> uh, let's look over here. I think this is the pit in the ground area, maybe. Possibly. Not positive. Oh, shit. Up, up, up. Thank you. Ooh, copper. Uh, doesn't help. I don't have a drill. <laughs> Mushroom forest down there. I know the coffee machine exists, because I've already found it once, but the game froze, so... We lost all that progress. So if I can't find it within, like, the next ten minutes, I'm just gonna give up. And we'll just try and proceed with crafting the thermal reactor chargers for the... Cyclops and the prawn suits. Because I bet this is interesting as fuck. Watch me just swim around the ocean. Trying to find wreckage that has a coffee pot and wreckage that has a freaking nuclear waste trash can. Still going west. The trash can, or the nuclear waste trash can, or the coffee pot, or both. <laughs> so, I mean, I can head towards the Aurora, it's not that hard. It's right over here, I think. Yeah, I'm really far away from it, too. Damn. <laughs> Baby Reef back! It's so cute! It don't got shit on its back! You're like if a weird sex thing, a tank, and a freaking manta ray had a baby. So cool. Hey, I'm just gonna... Scoot through the red grass dunes. I mean, uh... Yeah, you can drop the coordinates if you want. Uh... I think I need to look in debug mode to see the coordinates, though. Oh! Coffee machines by the Aurora, yeah. That would make sense, that would make sense. Ugh. Render lag. Render lag. Which... What way did I start going? Okay. 
1525252. I believe I have to bring up the debug menu though, right? Yeah, F1. Hey! Debug! Alright, let's see. Wank, wank. Camera world POS coordinates. Alright. So, 156. Haha! -ha. It's not a negative, so it's a positive 156. <laughs> We've got a ways to go then. Come on. Render. That's the Grand Reef. Just continue in a viscerally type direction until we hit like a 156. Now that would be a positive 156, right? Showing negative here. So I should, once I pass this point, it should switch up to positive. Yeah. Damn, it's a ways out here, huh? Alright. We're pretty close on that, so we're gonna have to try and figure out the direction we need to go to... Minus 252. I know we're losing the, uh... We're losing our 156 cord, but... I need to decrease that 1000, the... The, the other coordinate down to 252. I get grappled by something I don't want. I have it set up so I can just shock real quick. Hmm, slow the island. It's been a while since I've been out this way. Huh. 
<laughs> Sparse Reef, again. Now the question is, do we know what, uh, what direction affects which coordinate? I know the 25 is probably the up and down. Uh, the Z position. But what affects the X and what affects Y? North, south, east, west? Which one's which? Oh! Heavy lag. There we go. Oh boy, we're in the Sea Treaders Pass. Jesus! There's a ship down there. Alright. Let's get a head back real fast and see what happens. Ah, oh, look, I found the right direction. <laughs> it took forever. It looks like I found the correct direction. Caution. Blood nutrient levels decreasing. Calorie yeah, I know, I need food. He's not telling me anything I never know. Linda, why can't you tell me where our coffee pot's at, huh? Oh. <laughs> Let's skip the game a minute to load everything in. I've just been cruising about. For that right direction, you know, that just that that proper one that uh, decreases the numbers at the right rate. Slow down. The game render. There's life pod 17. I think we've been to 17 now. If I recall. Yeah, nothing in it. So let's continue this way. Oh. Oh, render. Yeah, yeah, but, uh, I, I'm not maritime, so longitude is lengthwise, so that's what, north-south, correct? And latitude should be, uh, east-west. Right? Am I recalling my, my, my knowledge correct, or am I bass backwards? Oh, kill a fish. Fucking honing in on it now. One fifty six. All 
Alright, so I was bass backwards. <laughs> Say this is it. Hey, that's inventory full. Emergency. Starvation imminent. Seek calorie intake immediately. Uh. Caution. Dehydration detected. See, there's a regular trash can. Inventory full, so that's an obtainable. Huh. There it is. Ha ha ha! Good call. There we go. Let's turn off debug for now. Let's go get food. Next step, coffee pot. <laughs> then, we are prepared to go and risk our asses at the uh, sea dragon. Just as soon as uh, we uh, we get the right charge abilities because, uh, well, those little tiny lava larvae suck out the power of your ship and it sucks. We have more than enough Reginalds in, uh, in this tank down here. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Froze on a screen where we struck a spade fish in the face. I'm not gonna starve to death. I am already on my way home. You get to witness the lovely screen right there of me smacking a spade fish. Welcome aboard, Captain. See, already here. We're not gonna starve that quick. Drink another water, though. Stabilizing. That land shark's still taking up a lot of frickin' uh, power. Alright. Let's see, I probably could grab, what, three? One Reginald, two Reginald. Oh, no. Probably had space for three. Apparently, I math way bad. Two Reginald should be enough. I think they give like 55 food from cooked. 44, that's still good. Vital signs stabilizing. Alright, let's. Let's actually, let's just take the time right now. Ooh, you son of a bitch. Let's craft this titanium, and I can probably turn him into titanium ingots right out the gate. And that'll give me more space to pick up more titanium and get more titanium ingots. How much space does that open up for me? Oh, it's a good old chunk. Alright, let's go grab more water from here. Yep. Stuck. 
on reactor. <laughs> There's a Dagagi, uh, blah, 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 a Dagazi base in the Grand Reef? Hmm. I knew about the one in the, uh, the Deep Mushroom Forest. I don't think I've ever found the one in the, uh, the Grand Reef. But again, I've never actually searched hard. Uh, trash can, blueprints... Two titanium for waste, uh, waste disposal. I mean, a regular trash can doesn't really matter. To gather more titanium, it's just to be easier to go back out and drop all this bullshit off at uh, Pit of Death. Let's see, because there's some, there's stuff right here. Inventory's full now. All the lag from the floating islands. Breaks. Render lag on a base. It's always my fear that one of these times I'm just gonna be traveling like that. Um <laughs> it's gonna render in around me, and I'm gonna be stuck inside of it. And yeah, Pit of Death is a good name for down here. Definitely uh getting down here is a pit of death, especially in the Cyclops, since every sea uh like bone shark and its mother wants to attack us. Up we go. And down we go. Don't worry, that lag you guys get is not from the stream. I'm getting it too. The lag is because this game is so unoptimized at times that it just takes everything a good computer has to fucking run it. It's rough. Cool. It's a little frustrating at times. Welcome aboard, Captain. I wonder if I upgrade to a 1080 Ti if it'll uh. If it'll alleviate a lot of that, that stress. Alright. Let's go... Titanium there. I'll even put a titanium engine in it, actually. Let's grab two. I know, I, I, I fucking change my mind every ten seconds. Let me... One... Do I have a power source that I can put in? Yeah, that's enough charge. This will be the craft locker. So I can keep stuff that I'm trying to work towards crafting in it, like, uh... That. 
titanium ingots. Turn my fan off. This room is a frickin' sauna right now. Holy shit. Alright. This nuclear waste deposit. Wonder if I can get it to sit like. <laughs> I don't know what that's going to do, but it feels nice. Crafted. Alright, let's check. Alright, so we're going to need three kyanite, three uranium and advanced wiring kit. Well, kyanite's all up here. I don't know. I don't know. That's I just wanted it because it felt like it was right. You know what I mean? Crafted, I think, is where I had the kyanite. Yeah. Just grab a whole handful. Bring it back to the base. Probably gonna set a notice up too that rolls in the chat. Like I don't know, every every hour maybe. And that notice is going to explain what uh, what commands people can use to check what they have. Like to check like what points you have and what rank you are, etc. Three kyanite advanced wiring kit. Marine fart, three uranium. Which I don't think we have enough uranium down here anymore. I think there's only one. Probably over here. Yeah, there's only one. But I think I converted all the uranium we had into power. Let's gather all the junk I put in here out. Yeah, like that. But it'll be a notice that rolls, and it's a, it'll give you like you, you can do that with rank, and you can do that with points too. Uh, you'll you'll earn points like a currency system. I don't know what I'm gonna put them towards yet. I'm just sort of like building up slowly, bit by bit. Yeah, it works fine. But I mean, I'm gonna add uh, 
I'm gonna add like a notice, and, and that, that like uh, extreme male should know what uh, what I'm talking about with the notice, because the notice was rolling on the uh, on the vodcast Sunday. Every every f 30 minutes, it rolled with a notice explaining to everybody. Because some people don't know that they're watching like a non-live stream, and that that can kind of hurt you whenever you're trying to get people to try and watch you, because then they think you're just ignoring them, which I'm not. I'm just really not there. And, uh, so it'll roll explaining, like, uh, what commands you have, what the, like, what you can use them for, what they do, and then maybe another notice will roll explaining, like, uh, you know, what you can put your points towards. Like, one of them is you, after, uh, X amount of hours watched and X amount of points gained, you'll be able to change your rank to a custom rank. So instead of you being known as, as... The, the, the interlaced ranks that I already have created, you can make your own up, whatever you want to be called. Whatever you want to be noticed as. But that takes a while. You know, it's set up like that on purpose to try and, you know, generate a want to watch. It's a gimmick. I won't lie. It's a fun little gimmick. I enjoy it whenever I mess around with it with other people. The idea that watching gives you more than just, you know watching, you know, you get more than just the entertainment, you also feel like you're interacting too. And you would be, I feel like some of the features I'm going to try and add, which again, I'm still just trying to get ideas off the top of my head, some of the stuff I'm going to add will give you the ability to interact a little, a little with, like, what's going on, maybe with, uh, like, some games or some raffles, or if I ever, like, if, you know, you know, once people, once I, if I do get partnered when it happens, you know, I start getting money from Twitch coming in, I can start getting some things to give away, you know, in a raffle and whatnot, and support, be, support the stream in that way, make it a little more fun than just sitting here and watching. Uh, voice log, damage to the plant life, motivational note, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, I need to grab more uranium real quick. Which I should have a good amount more in here. I also need some sulfur. I really wish there would be a way to, like, farm table coral. Like, yeah, I get it, the coral grows at a super slow rate on our planet, but maybe it's not the case on this one. Maybe the table coral, since it doesn't, since it looks a little more, less solid and more organic, the, uh, maybe it's an easier thing to harvest. It would be interesting to have a more farmable means, in my opinion. Uh, prawn suit, that's one of the things I want. The two more kyanite, three sulfur, and a plasteel ingot, that's something I want. And advanced wiring kits, two, and titanium, that's something I want. <laughs> yeah. Buy my channel for 20,000 points. <laughs> Not buying much right now, so. <laughs> Joke's on you. <laughs> Nah, I'd probably never give it away. I don't want to do that. I like it. Two... Plasteel and Sulfur. But yeah, you gain points at rates, like, uh, <laughs> mine's outrageous because, you know, I'm the owner of the channel and I use it just to test And that's kind of some of the stuff that you get right there. You know. Uh, basic plasteel. But I mean, I'll try and get like, I'm probably gonna like, depending on what games I'm playing, like this one I kind of, I like the, the music and the immersive sounds. I tried playing some music yesterday and it was alright in the beginning. But I actually like the soundtrack in this, but trying to get more sound, more music. I have friends that make music, I'm gonna see if they want to 
to make some music and put their stuff up on here and get a track rolling, and there'll be like, you could spend points to, you know, change the music, stuff like that. Let's see, advanced wiring kit, two, and titanium. So I need four copper. Four copper. Just the right amount in base of those. And I need the gold, which that's a wiring kit. That's a wiring kit. I think. I think it's only one gold extra. Let's check. Two gold. Alright, so I need two more. I think I need a ah, titanium. Yeah, people will be able to uh, spend points on, like, creating, uh, like, a custom greeting for yourself. Whenever you come in, you can give yourself a custom greeting. Like, right now, it's, it doesn't cost anything, but that's one of the things I'm going to work on doing, you know. You could come in and have the Necro Overseer give yourself, uh... Kind of? Yeah, a lot of people do it like that. It's interesting. <laughs> I've saw it a couple times... Like, I'm not, I'm not trying to make it too cheesy, but... Why... On what? Why? Now I'm curious, hold on. Wait a second. I I'll do it. Let me just do Welcome something. Welcome aboard, Captain. You've intrigued me. Cheeky. I like it. <laughs> The thing that's the problem, the thing that annoys me is it only happens, that only happens when the screen closes when crafting titanium and when you craft plasti lingots. But I do like being able to keep it open, that's nice. Thank you. That excites me. I think I need f uh, basically I'm vomit when I say it, I think I need five, uh, for the thermal on the frickin... Uh, whatever you want to call it, the Cyclops. I'll check in a second. Actually, I can check right now. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Two thermal. No, I need four. Nice, that's good. I actually probably can do that right now. I got spaghettis! <laughs> uh, polyaniline and three magnetite. I also wanted to get that too. Just because I like fancy things. But I feel like I want to get more decoy launchers. Ugh! They need a me they need a way to upgrade the upgrades. <laughs> upgrade the upgrade slots. Granted I already I probably won't need the power efficiency modules once I put on the uh, the charger. So I could probably take those away. Charger will take up one, and I'll probably put on uh, an extra decoy launcher. 
for Fuckface Dragon Magoo. So let's see, uh, decoy upgrade wiring kit to copper wire. That's not bad. That's easy to make. And this is five quartz, three kyanite, four plastiolingans. So... I might even be able to make that right here. Let's check. Yes. Ooh. Okay, I see. So it'll just keep it open, period. I like that. And that lets me know what I'm missing, too. Oh, that's... Yes! <laughs> Alright, so I've got seven, so I need three. There's three, so that's ten. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that should be three right there. And if I hop out, run down, grab the extra I have down there, because I don't want to waste titanium, because titanium is good building material too. One, there we go. Uh, there. Nope. Damn it. Not even close. One, two, three. And I have some up there on the uh, the actual Cyclops. right here. Ooh! <laughs> Fucking ran into the thing, like smacked my face off of it. <laughs> Alright. Another thing I've been putting, I I've been thinking of, because we're probably, we should be Rounding towards shut up, Linda. I'm talking to people. Damn it. Where was I going? Oh, yeah. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. And one, two, three. Like I was gonna say before, Linda freaking interrupted me because I'm gonna die of dehydration, apparently. Um. It's a cube! Uh, something else I was thinking about. This, uh, we're probably gonna round out to the end of where we can get on Subnautica. I know she loves me too much. She's like the creepy girlfriend that, like, you've broke up with and she still stalks you weeks after you broke up with her. But, uh,. I've been thinking of, like, other things to stream, and, uh, Tenocon, I don't know if anybody here is a Warframe fan, but I'm a huge Warframe fan, and Tenocon just released, and the Fields of Eidolon, they've added a 4x4 four four kilometer square map that, uh, a full 4x4 four four kilometer squared map that, um, well, it's free roam now. Uh, the fields of Eidolon, you could go out with a day-night cycle and just free roam. Anywhere you want to go. Pick up quests, missions, and that looks super exciting, but I don't want to just hop right into it for people that are going to watch and be like, well, what the hell is Warframe and how'd you get to where you're at now? Like, what's going on? So, I'm going to probably try and stream that. You know, and if it doesn't work out, people really don't like it. If it doesn't take off, I'll just record episodes and put them to YouTube. You know, YouTube's there for you to watch, for you to catch up on episodes that I'm not going to do, because Kerbal Space Program's one that, like, unless people, uh... Unless people be, like, head over heels interested in watching me try and play Kerbal Space Program live, I'm probably not going to do it, because I know, like, myself, Kerbal Space Program takes, like, a hot minute. 
to like to do things, to, to travel through space. It's just gonna be a lot of waiting. And that's stuff that I can edit out, you know. Well, let's just move all of this over here. But yeah, if you've never if you've never seen Warframe, look it up. Pretty fun. It's a free to play game, uh, made by Digital Extremes. They're out of London, Canada. Uh, London, Ontario, Canada. Uh, they, it, it, it's a great game, and a lot of the problems with free to play is it's like pay to win, but their game is everything you can pay for, you can get in the game. You don't actually have to pay a cent in the game. The most you'd have to pay for if you want to have more slots for your Warframes. That's the most you'd have to pay, and those don't cost much. It's like five bucks to get like three or four. So it's really, it, it's a really good game. Graphics are great. It's on it's on the Xbox, it's on the uh, PlayStation, and it was released on PC first. And I already have a lot accomplished. Just checking to make sure this is empty. I need to pull this at some point. Uh, I've accomplished a lot on, you know, the Xbox. But I would be fine starting over with a fresh account on PC and going from square one. That way everybody's in the story, everybody knows what's going on. The only thing with it, since it doesn't have like an ending, the game's just constant, like after you finish the stories, you can just do whatever. It would be like, uh, I'd probably do like an in-between. I'd probably stream it three days a week and stream something else more story-driven three days a week. That is my idea, anyways. So. That aside. I'm gonna grab two batteries. I think we are pretty much ready to go. I'll just uh, hop this bad boy into into here real quick. Charge him up a hundred percent. Welcome aboard, Captain. I'll even... I'm even gonna look into before we go, just to give us, like, that extra added security of defense. I'm gonna check what I need to make his torpedo arm. Magnetite and a computer chip. That's easy. I can make that right now. I just need to grab table coral from inside the... the Cyclops. And I will get us loaded up with shit to punch that dragon in the mouth, if need be. Uh, crafted, it, they should be in organic. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> oh! I panicked. <laughs> it's like, oh, shit. One, and the magnetites are in the base, so we can just copper wire chip. But also, there's other games, just besides the ones that I like to play, I'd like, I, I've mentioned. If you think you know something that you'd like to see me play, or you'd just like to see played, let me know. I can look into getting it, uh, and we can give it a whirl, you know? I'm open to anything. Wrong locker. One Mugnatite. Prawn suit. Torpedo arm. I think. Yeah, there's a the drill arm. Take the drill arm off, add the torpedo arm. I think it's just titanium and gas pods, yeah. Two gas pods, two titanium. And I have a good handful of gas pods, I grab those. Alright, by good handful I have four. <laughs>
Well, that's good. That makes three. So I'll have six. And then two titanium make vortex, so I'll probably craft six vortex as well. How much space do they take in my inventory? <laughs> that's a lot. <laughs> Just ram that bitch out the way. Torpedo bay. Ooh, it holds four torpedoes. A eh? switch, switch, take, take, switch, switch. All right. Load, load, load. Let's park this bad boy. Oh, so close. So close. Uh, let's pull the depth out of him. Put that in there. I don't have the means, I don't think. Let me, let me, let, let's see. One, two, three, three, four, five, six. God damn it. Every time. One, two, three. I'm just gonna pull three and I'll pull the other three from up on, uh... How much space is that taking up? I need to be careful, because I'm gonna take two titanium and make two more. Oh! Well, shit. Don't have the space for all that. Wait one second. Okay, well, let's go make, uh, three more torpedoes. Four gas. We've got two gas left. We've got four vortex if need be. Oh! Oh, we're gonna we're gonna make friends, all right. <laughs> we are gonna make friends. Let me see. What did I grab out again? Uh, I know what I was grabbing for. Exit. Do I have it in my inventory? I do. I do, I do, I do. If by make friends you mean shove every torpedo I have down his throat, then yeah, we are gonna be best friends. Oh wow, that freaking That jump jet upgrade is pretty aggressive. Welcome Ooh. aboard, Captain. All systems online. Ooh, I do not have enough. Do need to grow some. Alright, let's see. Organic. Crafted. Let's drop this and crafted. Pull that. Put those two. Those. Three, wrong way, fucking dumbass. Uh, we'll drop those cells. We're gonna definitely need to remember to take those with us. Probably should just put them in my inventory when I have the while they're fresh in my mind. Prawn suit arm can get stored here. No one can't. Take that back. I don't have enough fucking lockers. 
drop the bronze suit arm there. I know I could just craft some more, but I'm not going to. I'll pull this bronze suit arm too. And I'll drop it in here. Uh, so let's see. Let's grab two more titanium from up here. Let's equip the fab that I already had equipped. Let's grab these mushrooms. One, two, three. Let's see if there might be... I think this spot right here is probably far enough away. External module, external grow bed. Start growing some of those. Let's come in here and steal some water. Come on, come on, come. Stop. Stop getting stuck on everything. It's a tight fit, I know. Now we've got all the water we'll ever need to take with us. <sighs> Let's go in here and grab a couple Reginalds to eat. Well, I mean, I'm going to grab whatever is abundant. And it's looking like it's a spine fish. That was an eye eye, wasn't it? Yeah, let's, uh, let's drop him. One. Ooh. All right, I can see three Reginald, so I'm gonna grab a third one. Yep. Mm. Magmaray. Magmaray, get out of here. All right, let's drop. Let's drop him. Actually, this is gonna be too much food. I don't need that much. Let's consume some food. I pushed caps lock, not shift. Cause I'm fucking dumb dumb sometimes. Eat, eat. Have all the water in the world. Just drink some water. Still good on reactor rods. And making them isn't too bad. It's, uh, just three uranium crystals, lead, titanium, and glass. That was the biggest change I hated in this game. Uh, was when they changed the uranium from bright green crystals that are easy to see to those dark ones. this up here. Four glass. It's just one titanium. Yeah, it makes it so difficult to find them. I was, was a little irritated by it. I like overlooked like a ton of it because I didn't know it was uranium. And then finally I was like, oh, I'm gonna check this shit out. Fucking turns out to be titan uh, uranium, and that's what I was looking for the whole time.
Alright. Now they have tons of room. Alright, we'll change up the scanner. That has a good amount left in it. Come on, move forward. Thank you. We got two fully charged, we're gonna take two. You're gonna reload everything that can be reloaded. Okay. Let's go out and check those fucking devil mushrooms. See how much longer they have to grow. They're gonna take too long, we'll just roll out there with, uh... 69%. Yeah, I think we're just gonna go with 12 uh, power cells. <clears throat> Let's get this uh, show on the road. Well, they they might fully grow by the time I craft up. Uh, By the time I craft up the uh, the stuff I need for the decoys. So what do I have? I got the shield, I got the depth, I've got efficiency, but efficiency doesn't matter anymore because I've got this, so I might as well craft... What is it, a wiring kit and two copper wires? Yeah, two wiring kits and a copper wire, okay. Two wiring kits and a copper wire, and they cost a lot. I know that. They cost three titanium and copper wire. Mm. <sighs> well, I might be able to craft two. So what was it? Three titanium, copper wire, and a battery. Let's go make a wiring kit. Let's go grab one of those batteries I have charging. Ninety-five. Okay, they grow pretty fast. That's not bad. Two wiring kits. Copper, copper, kit, kit, this needs three titanium. I don't think I have that amount of titanium in here. Yeah, I don't. So I can make it back on the ship. Be back on the ship, be back on the ship. Back on the ship, 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 ship. Alright, if I'm gonna make six, I need one, two, that's one, that's two, that's three, that's four, that's five. And I think I have enough acid mushrooms up here to be six. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Am I right? Tell me I'm right. I am so not right. But there might- I think there's one in storage down there, so I don't have to worry about it. So I can take that last one. Last two, I should say. Five, six, two. I should at least start the chain of batteries and power cells. There's 
six. That should be good enough, in my opinion. Let's come back here and make this. Up to five, but I'm not going to put five in. I'm only going to put two for now. Should be all I really, all I really need, just in case. Ugh, I need a battery. Oh, son of a bitch. with me. Decoy beacon. I'm going to say now I feel 100% confident heading down here. Slow the decoy. We've got fucking torpedoes. We have got charging by uh Speaking of torpedoes, put it somewhere. Let's just load it in organic. It's organic, right? Right. Good enough. Close enough to organic, in my opinion. Let's drop this last uh, thing off right here. And I'm going to pull this into my inventory. Does it have a battery? Yeah, it's charged. It has battery. It's ready to go. I'm ready to go, we're ready to go. Let's turn off the interior lights, turn on the exterior lights. Hit the horn for fun. Engine powering up. <laughs> oh, I'm sure. Uh, there's one thing I want to do. Hopefully the game doesn't freeze. I'm attempting to alt-tab. I want to check... Fix one thing. Let's see what happens. Hopefully, it doesn't lock up. Probably should have saved and exited the main menu.
Okay, fixed. My hotkeys on my mouse weren't working. <clears throat> I have hotkeys on my mouse that uh, lets Boy, me go chocolate. up and down. And they weren't working. Which I didn't like. Initiate all the lag. Rig for Simon running. And thank you. Please don't swim in front of me, Majestic Ray. I don't want to kill you. I'm running over by accident. looking for a thermal charge meter, but there isn't one. There's one on the frickin' uh, prawn suit, but there isn't one inside the, uh, the Cyclops. At least not here. Maybe, maybe he'll be back in the engine room. I don't know. I don't know what that ray was doing, but Jesus, look at him spin.
all the dead fish. give a shit about that right now, bro. <laughs> I probably could make some kind of counter with uh, with uh, Phantom Bot for that, for you guys to keep track of the fish killed on stream. Alright, I'm gonna check. Energy is going up, so that's good. It's going up at a good rate, too. It's going up pretty quick. What's up, Chaotic? How are you doing? Welcome to the stream, my friend. Two. We'll also grab, uh, we'll grab the drill arm. No, I'm not. It's, it's stable. Well, I mean, as stable as stable can be in this game. <laughs> Nope, right now it's just a simple, stable, uh, hardcore playthrough. Which makes this, uh, this visit with the Sea Dragon very nerve-wracking. Alright. Alright, this is my grappling hook. Okay, that's neat. I probably should have tried it out before I just came down here to, like, have a friendly conversation with the Sea Dragon, but hey. Where's the fun in that? Oh, 
Uh, yeah, I played on Xbox too. They have a game-breaking bug right now in their system. Uh, as you can tell right now, like, I'm getting a lot of bugs too. Like, I mean, uh, my computer's not super powerful, but it's, it's good enough that it runs well in some areas, but a lot of the other areas it gets a little, little heavy. Oh, there he is. I hear him now. I don't know where he's at. But yeah, the Xbox is, uh... <laughs> I don't know. I'd have to think of one. I'd have to make a custom one for that command. But yeah, the Xbox right now is a little behind because they have a game-breaking bug that is keeping the the voice of the deep and uh, silent running uh, off their list. So, I mean, the best I can tell you is just to be patient with them. They're doing a good job. This is, uh... This is all the stuff you're missing right now. Well, we are missing, because I played on Xbox as well. Oh, crap. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. Where the fuck is the sea dragon? Oh, I don't like him being that close. Oh, wow. We go up super quick. Okay, there's the skeleton, so the entrance has to be on this side. Oh, come on. Sea Dragon, stop stop hacking the game right now so I can actually see where you're at. Oh, so you just have like an integrated graphics card, is that what you mean? Caution. Hydration detected. Uh, as you can tell, even with my 900 series NVIDIA, I'm having issues. Where the shit is this? Skeleton's right there. Come on. Come on. There's just so much happening right now that the, the, the between like that and streaming. Oh, you prick. It's supposed to be it's supposed to glow green. I need to I need to take a second and repair. If he grabs me, it's game over with that much damage. Vital sign. Skeletons there. Plus, the prawn suit's really buggy, too, in and of itself. Fuck out of here. Oh no. It warped me into my own poison.
he's real close. I need to keep an eye on him. I know it's not this high up, so I just need to get away from those freaking warpers. They keep pulling me out of the freaking sub. Wow, the prawn suit. Come on. Get off of me. I mean, they will attack or won't attack because. What an asshole. No, 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 no. Alright, I need to get out of here because this thing's just about destroyed. Can't tell what's going on. There's too much lag. Jesus Christ. Oh, what an asshole. Fuck. Shit. There's just too much lag. I can't do anything. I know this much, I don't have enough oxygen to mess around without a prawn suit. There's just too much lag right now. The game's being way too buggy. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems oh. online. Just saw a scan or something. I thought it was a scan symbol. Oh, right there. I see. Well, hopefully they're not draining all the power. I should all I should be making enough power to stay functional. Yeah. Yeah, it still kind of runs, still makes some sound. <laughs> yeah. I kind of figured it was going to get destroyed because once I got all that lag, there really was nothing I could do. I couldn't keep up with all the bullshit they were doing to me. Uh, trying to think... The entrance was supposed to be right around there. Now, the only thing I really lost that was on it was the thermal reactors and everything, and 
all that shit. But I have some more important stuff I kept off of it. Engine powering up. See, look, 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 look at that buggy. Rig for sight. I mean, with how buggy it was for what destroyed it, I'm thinking about it. Like, just look at the lag. Jesus Christ. And it wasn't this bad the last time we were down here. If you watch the video, it wasn't anywhere near this bad. So I feel like the computer needs to cache dump or something. I don't want to get too close because I don't want to attract assholes' attention. Engine powering down. I might have enough oxygen to get in and get out. I don't know a hundred percent. I probably shouldn't try it, but I'm going to because, well, can't help myself. We've come this far. There has to be an entrance there, somewhere. I need to grab some more water real quick. Vital signs stabilizing. do any of that craziness I'm about to try. Yeah, look at... Frustrating. Nope. Fuck off. All right, let's go back for oxygen. It's not that way. Yeah, I can try that. I'll give it a shot. I just want to keep an eye out for him. I don't want to be out there whenever he's out there. I'm not too worried about him attacking the sea uh, the Cyclops because I have two decoys. So, we can just wing it that way. There it is. Alright, we're trying it. I 
I just need to be careful because the lava kills you instantly in one shot. Holy fuck. Alright, that... It's a little far. I might actually need the prawn suit to get through there. I'll try and move the... No, fuck you. Leave me alone. I might actually have to move the Cyclops a little closer. Now this is going to be a test. Will he just flat out attack it when it's shut off?
Mensch. Yeah, there's a whole fuck ton. I feel like I've been... Was I muted that whole time? <laughs> I wasn't ignoring everybody. I muted myself to take a bite of food, and I don't recall if I unmuted myself. Let's check the charge. Hopefully we should be charging. Yeah, charge is going back up. Now, okay, I thought I was. <laughs> My bad. Took a bite of spaghetti and I didn't want to chomp in your ears and I forgot to unmute because uh, things get a little panicky with, uh, you know, sea dragon. So, like Chaotic said, you know, <clears throat> the only reason why I lost the prawn suit was because of that lag up there and I couldn't do anything because it just kept teleporting me around. So, what's the vote? Want me to spawn a new, another one in since the game lagged, or you just want me to leave and try and build a whole new one and all the stuff that was for it? Okay. That's fine by me. We'll just need to try and get out of here safely. Uh, I think I'll give going inside of there one last rip.
All right. <clears throat> oh. We are in. Uh, I'm not muted right now, am I? I, I was pretty sure I turned it back on. I just looked. If there's nothing coming through, there's a problem with the headset. Can you hear me now? Okay. What the fuck? How crazy is this? Yeah, no, sorry, I was just focusing <laughs> because of the lag, so I was trying to make sure that I was able to get through there with enough oxygen and without uh, killing myself by hitting lava by accident.
hear those little bastards walking. <clears throat> Don't know where they're at. Oh no. Two entrances and two exits. I don't like it. Because now I'm going to have to try and find my way through that fucking cave. Oh. Right. What the what? So So, <laughs> we're uh, falling through the world. So... Hmm... All right, with us falling through the world, I am gonna need to uh, mini that quick. So give me a second. going to attempt a console command to teleport me back to the uh to where I was So, this might take a minute. All right.
Yeah, majestical lags, right. You ain't kidding. All right, finally, let's see. What is all that noise? All right, trying to find the <clears throat> Yeah, right? I know there's a, an easy teleport. I'm just trying to look for it real quick. There we go. I don't want that one. I want to spawn Lava Castle inside. All right. So go to Lava Castle inside. All right. Let's try this. Need to hit F8. 
No, no, wrong one. No, 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 stop that. Stop, 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 stop all that. What's an F8? What was it? Something, then F8. F3, then F8. Okay. F3. Hmm. I have no idea what's happening right now. Oh my. Shit. Alright, it took a minute, but we're back in here. But, uh... That was, uh... That was some shit. I'm afraid to go through that portal. I don't want to have to deal with that again. I think... <laughs> Let me try something. gonna attempt to remove ambient particles. So... Maybe that will help. <laughs> I want to save it, but saving it quits all the way to the main screen. Unless... Let me see. I should be able to do this.
We'll try going through one last time before I end stream. And then we'll have to figure out what we're going to do from here. I'm waiting for the game to pick back up. If it crashed, we might not be going through at all. That's looking like what it might have done. Oh, nope, there we go. Okay, okay. Alright. We'll try going through one more time. Alright. on. Where are you taking us? This is like a nine-year loading screen. Jesus. <laughs> Can I go back? I'll just take my sub. This is the journey that never ends. And it goes on and on, my friends. Oh my god, it says we're only 91 meters, so we're pretty high above the ground. Uh... Hello? Is this seriously how long this is going to take? Come on now. Jesus Christ. You know what? I think that's a good place. This is a good place. Well!
I guess we're going to call it there for tonight. <laughs> it seems like a good place to leave off. So, we actually got inside the thermal reactor. We got the stuff from inside. We got contacted by the weird alien psychic thing that keeps talking to us. Uh, we lost the prawn suit, sadly. I'll take the time to get that rebuilt and restocked up. That way we have one. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen with this uh, loading screen right now, the teleport, because it's still teleporting me. Like, I'm watching it right now while giving you the little outro I'm giving. But, yeah. So, Death, as always, thanks for being the regular in chat. To uh, Extreme, who's here still kind of lurking in chat, at least it says he is. You know, thanks for joining, thanks for watching all the uh, previous episodes. Death, thanks for watching the episodes you need to catch up on YouTube. Uh, to the guy Chaotic who stopped in, you know, thanks for, thanks for stopping in and saying hey. I guess I'll figure out what to do with this. I'll, I'll try and make it work without losing our save. Uh, I guess, till then, you know, I'll catch you guys tomorrow night, and hopefully tomorrow night we'll be picking up wherever uh, this portal has taken us, or at least back at the base, one of the two. Till then, I'll see you guys tomorrow night. Thanks for having me, thanks for joining. Necro out.